welcome back to our channel. Hey Gentle Giants, welcome back to our channel. We're back with another video and we are back with another challenge. Yeah. Gang, gang. <laughs> <laughs> Um, comment down below before we start. Yep. Comment down below if you're Team Caesar or Team Zandi. Yep. Guys, let us remember know. Remember where your bread is buttered. Let us know. <laughs> let us know. Guys, you know what, man? If you are going to comment Team Caesar, comment Team Caesar, baby. But I want to be honest with you. This one, <laughs> Sayoyik. <laughs> Sayoyik. And before you get into the video, if you're still staying at home and still staying safe and still abiding by the lockdown regulations, like this video. Yeah. All right. I think the only thing I feel bad about for these challenges, like, is that my wife is so pretty, no? And beating someone so pretty, like, I just feel so bad. <laughs> I thought like, you were gonna beat me. Yeah, like, I feel so <laughs> bad. She's such a pretty girl, but I'm like, Ish, but I have to whip that butt. <laughs> 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 but anyways, we are starting with a new challenge, new segment altogether. Yep. And this segment is called Five Things You Should Know. Yep. Today's segment is Five Things You Should Know About Your Qualification. Right? Yep. So we're going to be testing each other. Uh, I'm going to ask him five questions about his qualification and he's going to ask me five questions about my qualification. Right? Yeah. And we um, actually want to see if we still remember some of the things about our qualifications yeah because it's been said that you only use like a small percentage yeah. of what you studied in varsity or what you studied in college oh, in or what you studied general. studied in high school yeah. yeah or what you studied in high school or primary you only use a very small percentage of um those that qualification mm. or those learnings um, within your later life of your career or whatever you end up doing. Yeah, but we also want to see if did our parents waste their money or not. My mom better not bother. She's, she's going to be disappointed. Anyway, guys, uh, just to give you a bit of context, uh, my wife and I both went to the University of Johannesburg. Shout out to the UJ gang. And if you, also went, <laughs> if you also went to UJ, uh, like this video as well, just to just to give us a shout out. If you know where the D labs are, like this video as well. Yeah, uh, I studied uh, geology. My wife studied marketing and communication. So yeah, so yeah. those are the questions we're gonna be asking each other about. And yeah, guys, uh, maybe you can also learn something about our careers and the things we do. <laughs> what a joke! Our qualifications and yeah, but let's get right into the video <laughs> who said it's gonna go that way <laughs> make it go that way i'm gonna make it go that way just, just, just to, just to make it look <laughs> <laughs> you're so mean okay guys let's get into the video <laughs> all right then you're gonna start you no, can you go start. you start ah you start ching chong ching chong, ching -chong. Ah, babe. What? Uh, eh. Ching chong cha. Hey. Oh. Hey, ma. Ching chong cha. Ching chong cha. Ah! <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> Alright. I hope the answers, ne? I hope you have the. Don't the answers. You? No, yeah, I have the answers written. Okay. Yeah. So, my first question <laughs> What are the minimum? APS points one requires to study marketing and communications at the University of Johannesburg. Zwandi, that's not. Yeah, it's part of your qualification. You need to know everything Zwandi. about your qualification. Zwandi, that's not. You're gonna do career guidance and all of that. No, I studied marketing. You 20... need to tell them. 24, 27. What? 24, 27. Give me one answer. 24. Nope. 27. Yeah. Just... Ah! Please, I, that's why I gave you a chance to give me one uh, answer. Uh, baby, give me, no, give baby, me. no, baby. This is I have a real question anyway. But yeah, this is war. Sharp. Give me your question. Nice try. But it was a white guess. Like, I'd understand if you said 26, 27, then maybe. No. But 24, 27. No, because I can't bring it out. 24, I can't bring it out. I'm speaking about your qualification. I know. What I did know. you need? I know. Exactly. Okay, my question is. Yeah. What no, is no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Want to watch a secret? Some of my students don't watch this. Like they're gonna be like, ah, I'm zoned in. So like a two timers next. Okay. What is magma? Magma is like molten rock. So what? magma, magma is like molten rock. It's like molten rock. Magma is like Define lava. Define molten. Like very make it simplify it. What's okay, molten? Okay, so. What you have is a volcano. Don't be too deep. Babe. No, What's yeah, molten? Happen. What's molten? It's magma. Molten is magma. Mo um, you what? What was your question? What's what magma? What is magma? Yes. It's molten rock. What? Meaning it's lava. If you know what lava okay. is. Okay. So melted rock. Not yeah. You can put it that way, but it's not melted. Melt rock. No. It's melted rock. You don't say melted rock. Okay, then I'm not giving you this. I'm no, it's correct. It's melted rock. But I'm correcting you. No. It's not, it's no. No, I'm getting that point. No. It's lava. That's what it is. No, it's not lava. It's melted rock. That's why I mean it's melted rock. Melted rock. M E L T. M E L T. -E you know what melt means? Baby, lava is melted rock. Magma is no, melted it's rock. Lava. It's no, lava. It's not lava. It's Yo. melted rock. Zero. No, one. Zero. So I no, baby. I baby it's two. molten rock. Uh, next question. I have one. No. I know that I have one. <laughs> Cool. Next question. Who is the father of marketing? <laughs> Answer, please. <laughs> Babe. I don't know. That's, you don't know. Why would you ask me that? You need to know about your I qualification. Want, dude, that's not my qualification. We didn't learn about that. Everyone, that's a lie. It's either you missed your first lesson or, or you like, guys, everywhere, whatever Who's you are studying, wait, wait, whatever you are studying, that first lesson, they kind of give you a background of that particular field of study. They let you know about the history of that particular field of study. Answer. So you should have known. Who is it? Philip Coulter. I just want to do it, honestly. <laughs> Next question. So it's one zero. Yep. Yeah. What does the study of geology also include? What do you mean? What does it include? Like, what does it, it also include the study of what? The universe, animals as well. Oh, oh rocks. it's rocks, it's rocks, and guys, let me tell you. So Geology mean, is a science extravaganza. We study animals. <laughs> <laughs> we study animals, the planet, the universe, everything. What else? It also includes the study of the ocean floor. Oh. Next. What do you mean? Next, to something. Like that people. question. That Zero. is not a good question. Zero. I feel like, yeah, no, you don't ask me good questions. I feel like if Zero. I was in a class, okay. Babe. If I was in an exam. I would be those students that say, please explain this question in order for me to be able to give you a good answer because it's not a good question. Well, you didn't ask. Wow. I know. Okay, cool. What are the elements of the marketing and communication mix? The elements? Yeah. Like your question. No, but I'm asking for help. You didn't ask for help. Oh, tell me. Five. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Could be five. Could be ten. Who knows? Oh, babe, please, come on. It depends on what you studied. How many are Okay, there? what did you study? You know what you studied, so give me what you know. The marketing, the elements, I don't know what the elements are. Like, I feel like the answer I'm gonna give you is not what I'm thinking. Okay, give me, let's see. No, what are give the elements? Me. Ah, baby, give me. No, I don't know. Ah, this girl, disappointed, baby. This thing, guys, don't date in varsity because look, look now. Yeah, there you have them, you're counting them. Let us know. No, it's not those ones. Okay, give me one. 
It's not Okay, them. whisper, whisper. <laughs> like, if you don't like marriage yourself, whisper. <laughs> <laughs> then I'll say, then I'll say, nah, let's move on. <laughs> yeah, that was it, man. <laughs> no, it's not them. Just I tell me why. Yeah. No, I'll... No, nah, let's move on. I'm <laughs> not being married. Yeah, you were going to be embarrassed yourself. As I give you. Yeah. So mix consists of advertising, public relations, sales That's promotion. Too many things, babe. Wait, okay, but people want to learn also. So I'm also, <laughs> so let me start all over. Advertising, public relations, uh, sales promotion, personal selling, and direct marketing. Okay. Yeah. In the bag. Oh. I remember that. Okay, your question. But that's too many things for you to ask me. I mean, I'm asking you straightforward questions. But one of the fundamentals of like with marketing, like you cannot not ask that. What is Mount Rushmore made out of? What? Mount Rushmore. What is it made out of? Mount Rushmore. Mm. Okay, wait. Can I okay, now I also need a clue because I know this as two phenomena. One is a process and one is an actual mountain. Okay, give me both of them, this is a one of Okay, them. so Rushmore What is it made out of? Okay, so it's actually a mountain, that's what it means I'm gonna go with So you're actually asking for the rock type that makes up the mountain Babe, that's not what I said, I said What is Mount Rushmore made out of? I think granite, could be made out of granite Granite and metamorphic rocks Igneous and metamorphic rocks because you didn't your question is open-ended. Is it a rock type? Is it an actual rock or what? What is Mount Rushmore made out of? Give me your final answer. What do you mean? What is it made out of? Give me your final answer. It is made out up of igneous rocks which are granites. I'm going to give you one last try. I'm going to give you one last try. Don't overthink this. What is Mount Rushmore made out of? Rocks. Babe, is that your final answer? I'm like, not gonna I don't ask get it. What is it I'm made out of? I'm not gonna ask you anymore. I'm okay, not gonna ask you, you know what? You know what? Yeah, give me your final answer. Made, like so, composition. Igneous rocks, which are granites, which have a composition of granitic rocks. That's what I'm going for. I'm sticking to my guns, eh? Oh, lava. Huh? What? Lava. You're wrong. It's made out of a big igneous rock. <laughs> no, I was right. You are right, but you just got that answer. Okay. Well done. <laughs> oh my god. So you're using like. <laughs> That's what you did with the 24, 27, 18 episodes. I said choose one. I exactly said but choose I, one. But you kept even out there. You said. As igneous if I was wrong. And metamorphic. No. Like igneous and metamorphic. But and that was like, babe, final answer. Why? Okay, guys, bottom line is that I'm getting all these answers right. Whether no, that's you're not, not true. Getting, but it, it, it's correct. My first answer, which I was confident ah, about, I gave it to answer. you uh, like twice. Ah, ah, babe. Okay, cool. Let's move on. Next question Who is the head of department for marketing management at UJ? Now. Now. When you were studying, whether you were studying or now, Mark, because head of department. Yeah. <laughs> Who was the HOD again? And apparently, this person has been a lecturer at UJ for 15 years and an HOD for quite some time. Hence, I'm kind of including the times you were there. Is it Davies? Something Davies? No. No. Who is it? Professor Marius Wait. When I was there? Yep. Hi, 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 hi. And you must know mass, who know? And you must know mass, who know? No. <laughs> Don't you? I even know this guy. I know him. I even know him. Wait, wait, let me see. I even know him. Like, next question. Who is John Wilson? 
John Wilson. Yeah. Whoo! Not Wilson name. John Wilson is the author of one of my textbooks, I think. Oh, that's another question. Yeah, I think John Wilson is one of the authors of one of my geology textbooks, I think. Who is he? John Wilson is the father of plate tectonics. Mm. Wait, who's, th this is your last one, eh? Yeah, this is my last one. Yeah. Okay, so my last question, guys. My very last question. Hey, listen. What sits at the top of the Maslow hierarchy for marketing? The product. Nope. Self-actualization. Self-actualized. Yep. Anywho, my last question is, who is David Johnston and how did he die? David Johnston. Yeah, what was he? Scientist. Okay. <laughs> Say the name again. David Johnston. David A. Johnston. What was he and how did he die? Did he not die from radioactivity or something like that? Okay, Ooh. incorrect. <laughs> he was a volcanologist. What? Volcanologist. And he died from an eruption. Hmm, okay. He died from an eruption of Mount St. Helens. They hmm. even give you a picture 13 hours before his death. Like he's there chilling, waiting to die. <laughs> Look at him. Okay. Yeah, and guys, that is the end of so our. So I'm the winner, right? Uh, how many you got right? I got Why? Planet. Yeah, how many did you get right? <laughs> Don't look at me like that. Well, yeah, I guess you're the winner. This is, like, this is such a bad score. Like, we need one more 5 4 win type of Which thing. Which like, just shows who I think so one that. person, yeah, you got more questions right, even though I'm not giving it right. But you have an idea. But look me, like, I don't do this stuff anymore. Like, I remember it, but like not in deep, not as detailed as you. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. ah, babe. Give me my win. Yeah, and get but my win and no, let it end there. also another thing is that you are a geologist, so you work with this stuff. It doesn't matter. Now you have the qualification. I'm not a I'm not you, are, a you have the qualification. At I, the end of the day. I, but anyway, guys, we thoroughly hope you enjoyed this video. And yeah, man, in order for you to be a gentle giant, you need to subscribe to our channel. So subscribe to our channel if you want to be a gentle giant for more cool videos. And let us know of this challenge. Shout out to Team Zwandi. Why don't you give a shout out to Team Zwandi? For you. But I give you a shout out when you... It was your cool. choice. Cool. <laughs> but anyway, guys, um, yeah, we'll see you with another video soon. And yeah. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>